Recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I want to thank my friend from Missouri for yielding his leadership on the Transportation Infrastructure Committee. Mr. Speaker, I rise today in strong support of H.J. Res. 27, providing for congressional disapproval of the Army Corps of Engineers and EPA's rule expanding the definition of waters of the United States. This rule is one of the latest examples of regulatory overreach that the Biden administration has chosen to pursue, ignoring Congress's role in making policy decisions and vastly increasing federal authority over private lands. Expanding the WOTUS definition creates harmful uncertainty and increased administrative burdens for many parts of our economy, especially our farmers and agriculture sector. On top of having to endure the effects of high inflation, supply chain disruptions, and labor shortages, farmers in my district and across the country now have to invest more time and money on compliance costs to protect themselves against potentially grip crippling legal penalties. Between President Biden's attempts to repeal stepped-up basis, the SEC's onerous ESG proposal, and now this WOTUS rule issued by the Army Corps of Engineers and the EPA, it is clear that family farms and small businesses are not being prioritized or heard by this administration. As a representative of one of the largest... I, 15, the thank gentleman you. is yielded an additional 30 seconds. As a representative of one of the largest corn and soybean producing districts in the country, I understand the importance of our farmers have in feeding our nation and the world. Our farm economy is the lifeblood of rural communities, and this resolution is necessary as a first step in supporting our farmers and small businesses. I urge adoption of the resolution, and I yield back the balance of my time.